So you're thinking about moving to Flagstaff, Arizona. My name is Tammy with Flagstaff, Arizona Living, and I will show you all around Flagstaff. I like to highlight the different neighborhoods in town. We've got east, west, north, south, just like every other place. We're a small town, but we are surrounded by lots of cool, exciting, like the Grand Canyon and Sedona. Phoenix is only a couple of hours away. So today we are in the Continental Country Club area. It is on the east side of town. It's close to our mall. I'm curious if everybody else's malls in town are going downhill. Ours is, but there is now a bowling alley there. So I'm definitely gonna check that out with my kiddos and my family. Anyway, so today we're gonna see a few houses and a few different price ranges. As you can see, we always got our pine trees here. This is a really beautiful area. There's definitely HOAs here, so that you're not gonna see a lot of extra vehicles parked on the road or um, like your boats and your RVs if you have that equipment, hunting equipment or whatever, I don't know. You're gonna have to park it somewhere else. That's all I know about HOAs. All right, let's go. All right, so this house behind me is 3,700 square feet. It's $925,000, four bed, three bath. It's a beautiful home. It looks like there's quite a few garages back in there. Kind of tucked away, it's right here on a corner. And across the street is actually, this is one of the golf courses over there. Um, lots of birds. If you zero in, you can see the Canadian geese over there kind of um, munching on the, I don't know, grass seed? What are they, what are they getting? I'm gonna have to look that up. A whole bunch of Canadian geese are covering our golf courses right now. There's snow on the ground. We just got our first snowfall yesterday. And then the sun comes out and it melts everything and it's beautiful again. So I like our winters because we get a little bit of snow and then a lot of sun and then a little snow and a lot of sun. All right, so this next home across the street is four bed, three bath. It's 3,700 square feet and it's listed for $1.15 million. It's the one with the white house and this deep driveway. Right across the street is this beautiful access to one of our golf courses here. Um, again, it's not in a cul-de-sac. It's in a really heavily treed area, really beautiful, lots of aspens that have just lost all of their leaves. And there's a lot of bigger homes back here that I haven't seen before, steep driveways. That's very popular to have in Flagstaff is a really steep driveway. So it's gonna head up that way. Um, over here you can see they must be winding around to get up to their house. You can find driveways that aren't steep, um, like this one right over here. Well, actually, there's one that's flat and then there's one that goes down to access another part of their yard. But sometimes the best houses have steep driveways. So when my husband and I bought our house, um, I pulled up to the house and I was like, nope, not getting out. That driveway is way too steep. I know I'm not getting out of the car. And then I was like, fine, I'll go inside and see it. And I loved it and it was like move-in ready. We got it for a great deal. And the steep driveway is only an issue a few days out of the year. It's not a big deal all the time. It's only a big deal some of the times. And sometimes I tell my kids, I'm like, put on your seat belts, say a prayer, here we go. And we're backing down. Sometimes we slide a little bit. Um, but I guess that's part of the adventure of life. These townhomes are going for 575, three bed, two bath, 1300 square feet. And there's actually a couple of them um, right next to each other that are for sale. And if you look down here, this is where the golf course is. And um, there's actually an entire family of deer down there. It's hard to see on the camera. But when I, when I was driving by, I realized there's like all of these deer just kind of chilling over there. I might see if I can get a little bit closer. I'm definitely parked in somebody's driveway, but you know what? If I have to do this for my fans, I'm gonna do it. I just hope I don't slip, because look at what I'm dealing with right now. Lots of slippery. Okay, I wanna see if I can get to these deer. They are so beautiful. Oh, I see one standing up. Somebody's gonna come out here and be like, man, you're trespassing. And I'm gonna say I'm doing it for the shot. 
Okay, here we go. Um, right there, do you see him staring at us? That guy right there? So there's <laughs> one, two, three. Oh, here comes another one walking around. Oh, I'm chasing them away. Mama bear, mama. Oh my gosh, there's like six or seven more up in this area. So this would be the backyard of um, this beautiful continental townhomes over here. And there's a lake across the street that had a whole bunch of duck and geese in it. And then there's probably like 15 deer down there, just chilling, just hanging out, like they own the place, probably because they do. <laughs> they're like, hey, you know what? We were here before you. We're not going anywhere and we don't want them to go anywhere. We want them to stay. All right, so that concludes my tour of Continental Country Club area here in Flagstaff. Don't forget to like and subscribe my page and tap the bell for notifications. And you can email me, call me. I'd love to show you around Flagstaff. Have a great day.